Hey guys, it's the Bling Gypsy coming back at you with another training idea. So I'm going to show you how I organize my rings. I'm going to flip this around. Alright, so this is a large thread holder. And you can see it's got a stand right there. So it is collapsible. And I put my rings on here. Each item keeps the number until it's sold out. So this ring, for instance, is number 30, 40, sorry. Now I use these key um, tags. They come with little rings, but they were not as easy to put on and off. So I went with these um, binder clamps, I guess, they're reusable. And I'll include all the links to the items in the description. So while I'm showing my rings, and I show this ring, um, and I'll say it's number 40 and if it sells I just go to the, my overstock bin number 40 and grab one um, This is also good because when the customers are here shopping they can still try the ring on and They're not going to move it from slot 40 to a different spot and then all of a sudden my inventory numbers are all messed up so This is how I do that um, You are going to need do this project you're going to need <clears throat> some kind of a stickers some round stickers or you know whatever you want you're going to need <clears throat> this which is the stackable bins this is from harbor freight um, there's 20 in a box and it's like ten dollars for the box you're going to need a glue gun and of course a marker and here is the end result so that thread holder holds 120 rings so I got 120 bins I stacked them 12 high and as you can see I numbered them with the yellow stickers the pink stickers means that there's no rings in this bin so if I'm live and I sell number 30 I can just look behind me and say oh nope that's one and done because I don't have any more because there's a pink sticker <clears throat> as you can see I just did this so there's a lot of pink stickers right now um, I need to order some more rings but, um, and you do have to hot glue these, by the way. Can't really see it. See, I got them hot glued because they do not stay together. I hot glue all my bins anyways, just for safety. All right, so this makes it really easy. So if I sell number 31, I can look over here and see there's no pink sticker. I can come over here and just grab that ring and put it in their basket um, so this is a great way to organize your ring overstock um, and I went with these because the ones that I use for my regular inventory are much larger and the rings are so small they kind of get lost in there um, so those are for my regular inventory these are from Dollar Tree um, but the tiny gray ones are from Harbor Freight so, I will include the links to uh, all the items that I use in the description. If you guys have any questions, comments, concerns, please let me know. Um, and, uh, yeah, like and subscribe our video for more upcoming videos. Bye.